Hi friends, here is a swelling which is present on the back of the chest and we are going to describe all the points of a swelling. First of all, you should also consider that <clears throat> from how long that lump is being present, whether the lump was noticed first it was seen or it first appeared. What was the mode of onset? Are there any other symptoms with related with, with the lump? And what is the status of the swelling? Whether it was progressive and how fast? Whether it was associated with the fever or any other secondary changes? First of all, you should examine, you should see the situation and where it is lying. What is the color? What is the shape? Size? And the surface can you see the edges and what are the number of the swelling or the lump and can you see any visible pulsations or peristalsis whether the lump is moving with the respiration is there any impulse on the cuff and if the lump is on the throat region whether it moves with the deglutition or it moves with the protrusion of the tongue what is the status of the skin over the swelling and if, as here you can see the veins are visible while palpating you can see the temperature you can palpate the tenderness you can also see the surface what lies under that surface is smooth or as some fluid is there or any bosselated feeling is there you can see the shape and extent you can also palpate the edges you, can, you will also come to know the consistency, any fluid is present there or any fluid thrill is there. Now using the torch you can see the translucency, whether you can hear any bruit on auscultation. So these all are the points which need to be seen while examining a lump or the swelling and uh, here it is a case of sarcoma. Maybe in evening sarcoma involving the ribs, etc. So, this is how one should take care of the lump examination. Thank you for giving your valuable time.